this is the this is the raw egg, which is oh, really? see what it's like. It's actually it's like a, you know what I mean. It's like a boiled egg. It's like a balloon that's full of water. Except you don't want to push it too far. So that was what we had in there. See how I wondered about the size? Like it's huge, isn't it? So we we'll just put that one to a side. But I'm really happy that the vinegar soaked. That's a cool trick in itself. Um, to get kids, <laughs> to just do that. I don't know whether after three days it would completely lose the skin and you, the egg is just waiting, the membrane just waiting to explode. It's really cool. But this, so this here is then, this was a hard boiled egg soaking in vinegar, I don't, which is not necessary, I don't think. So that's just, just feel like, it's just like a hard boiled egg. That, nothing extra has happened to it. So I'll pop that away. It's like a cook, either cooking show or play school. I'm not sure Here's which yet. Here's what I prepared earlier. <laughs> Um, but here we have nothing too dramatic, just two hard-boiled eggs. But you reckon they should be soft-boiled, right? Yeah, see, I have, I have, I have had a lot of um, listeners call up and text during the week saying yeah. it needs to be soft-boiled because that allows it to have the, the room to move, if that makes sense. Like, whereas if it's all hard in the middle, you've got no flexibility. Okay, there. can I just look at this? Can I just show you? Okay, it, so it's, it might even just go straight in. Look at the size difference between Shelley's egg. Look, it's almost like the... Sabotage. Yes. She's done this to make you look stupid. I think we're gonna. I think we've got the solution straight away. That it's just That's so much, much smaller. More okay. So maybe we'll try it later. You know, part four, part five of this will be taking a smaller egg and, and putting it in vinegar. Raw. We could do a whole TV show based on. We are. Spencer's egg. Is okay. So the other thing is, yes. quite a few listeners this morning were saying that you need to wait. You put it in. You put. Flame egg. Yeah. Whereas they were saying flame. Oh, let it burn a bit. Then egg. Okay. The idea behind behind it'll use up more of the oxygen first, and then somebody said something about waiting to cool down. Okay. Oh, this okay. is the other thing that's suggested. This is suggested. cheating, I reckon. Do you? Do you okay, we'll try one without. Right. Okay. Just try one without. All right. Thanks to whoever provided the. So just lubricating the egg or the bottle. Well, no, no, provided that in the work for Oh yeah, yes, that's true. So you got, you're going to like that. And that's for you to push it into the pot, because Steve almost burnt himself. So you get a fork. Okay. You almost need to have it in the bottle when you start lighting it. And the trick, obviously, is the temptation is to turn upside down so that it will burn faster, but don't because it will burn yourself. Why not? Oh, well, you can try that. It's just not really catching. Kids, don't try this at home. Go next door and try it there. It's not burning. It's not burning. But what am I meant to do about just, it? Okay, just light it a little bit more. I just did. Mm -hmm. Okay. right now that, that I have decided to post the full version of this video that you are watching this four hour video. So that's the cool thing about online videos, you just click to the end. Presumably the end of this video will, will show success but it's happening. Got the egg ready. Yeah. I 
gonna dare turn around and look to see if there's anyone from my property department watching. Okay. Thin a piece of paper. He says I just rolls the paper again. So no, that's half a piece of paper. Dylan, who's holding the camera, has a, you know, a suggestion. His arms are probably too mm -hmm. stiff. He's tired. Um, this is getting a bit ridiculous. We can't even like a piece of paper. What do you think, Dylan? I don't know. <laughs> I'm out of suggestions. The grade for your internship on <laughs> Well, okay. Let's try a different type of paper. Maybe the paper is like... Designed to not start fires in offices. It's unflammable paper. Um, newspaper? Tissue. Like tissue. Or, um, newspaper would work. Newspaper. We've got plenty of that. Newspaper. Which paper shall we use? Which paper shall we burn? Now there's one. There may be too much paper in there. Or is that the one? No, because I don't think we want to start. Okay. not the egg, the problem is having a flame in the bottle. Can we empty the bottle out Ooh, again? Oh, there's suction. Yeah, there was suction before when we tried the really big egg. Oh, that's good suction. Okay. <laughs> Running out of gas in the lighter, that's what we wanted. I think Dylan's suggestion of newspaper could be the go.
all these pieces of paper coming out of here are actually worn. This is why we have a science grad working on the program. She's basically going to do the whole experiment on her own. What was what did you think? It was too long before you poked it in, or you poked I reckon it was too long. long. It's maybe too long. Out again. Yeah. So you need a smooth poking in process. Okay. There's a line there, but I'm not touching. needs to drop all the way in. Okay. Uh, is, it, is it still burning? No. Okay, I think, do that again, but let it um, burn a little bit longer in your fingers before you uh, drop it in. Okay, that's the look of despair. Theory's welcome. Suction again, but it's just a matter of having the. How does. How do you keep it laying inside? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? How do you keep the paper alight inside the bottle? Should we should be ashamed. Hmm? Should we be put ashamed? Now remnants of burned Guardian Weekly in someone's margarine. Okay. So you, have you just done that? Professor Julia Sumner Miller. We did it! Okay. You can hit the stop button. 